The Yen Bai Museum, covering 2,700 square meters, showcases a plethora of historical and cultural artifacts and documents. It serves as a vital destination for the younger generation and tourists to learn about local culture and history. Most domestic and foreign visitors are interested in learning about the embroidery on local ethnic minority outfits. The museum has therefore focused on collecting and promoting the unique features of local embroidery. Yen Bai is home to 30 ethnic minority groups, each with its own distinct culture. With more than 130 recognized heritage sites and items, including one special national heritage site and 12 national sites, Yen Bai has an abundance of cultural treasures. Five intangible cultural heritage items have also been included on the list of national intangible culture. In particular, swear dance of local Thai ethnic people has been recognized as an intangible cultural heritage of humanity by UNESCO. I am from a Thai ethnic minority group. I was happy and proud when swear dance was recognized as an intangible cultural heritage of humanity by UNESCO. This helps promote tourism in the locality. To preserve ethnic minority cultures, Yen Bai has undertaken a host of initiatives to restore traditional festivals and crafts, and collect, research, and preserve folk songs and dances of different ethnic minority groups. The province also encourages the preservation of traditional outfits, architecture, and musical instruments, and holds classes to pass down cultural values to the younger generation. Most local people here know traditional dances. They are not that difficult to learn. We also teach dances to children at kindergarten. Yen Bai has become known as a safe, friendly, and attractive tourist destination in recent years, thanks to its breathtaking, unspoiled natural scenery and unique ethnic minority culture. Leveraging these advantages, it is diversifying its community-based tourism offerings, to attract both domestic and foreign visitors.